You done taking a shit? Uh, yeah. What do you need, Dad? Son, I think it's time we go outside and have a discussion about the birds and the bees. Uh, Dad, hate to break it to you, I'm 32 years old. I don't give a shit. You're never too old to learn a thing or two from your pops. Let's go. Where are we going, Dad? We ain't going nowhere, son. We're gonna sit here and I'm gonna tell you a thing or two about birds and the bees. Dad, I'm, I'm, like I said, I'm a little too late for that. It don't matter. Basically, not all flowers smell the same. Some might smell like nothing, and others might smell like the deadliest catch. Which reminds me. One of the deadliest things I ever caught was your mom's gonorrhea back in the 70s. Dad, I don't need to know no, about that. No, son, yeah, you do. That was one of the stinkiest, most deadliest things I ever that's done caught. That, Dad, it doesn't matter, son. That's what I'm trying to teach you. You don't know. Teach me about mom's gonorrhea? No, I'm teaching you about the birds and the bees. And all flowers ain't the same. Especially about flowers? Are you talking about a woman's vagina? That would be what I'm talking about. Are you, you said you're 32. Where's your fucking brain, man? All right, Dad. Yeah, Come on. okay, Dad. Let's cut to the chase. What, what the hell are you trying to teach me? I'm teaching you about different smells. Different flower okay. smells if you catch my drift. I'm catching it. Basically, number one, we're going to start with this. Your mom. She was the most putrid smell I ever caught. Most putrid. There ain't even a name for it. It's just called Oy de Mom. Dad. Oy de Mom. That's disgusting. You know what it's like? What? It ain't disgusting, man. It's like, think of it like this. It's like when you fart and you like to smell your own fart. I, I do That's understand how I that. That's how I feel about your mom. <laughs> I do understand that. That's how I feel about your I mom. I try to fart on purpose sometimes just to take a whiff. I get it. And I, <laughs> you probably learned that from me. I mom. probably did. You probably did. Yeah. But that's how I feel about your mama. Your shit stinks so bad, but I love it. I love it. Dad, are you telling me you brought me out here to the truck just to talk about mom's flower? Her stinky flower? No, man, I was just looking for an excuse to get out of the house because she's trying to bang me, man, and I ain't on... I'm when not, I'm in the house? She was. I can't help what your mama does. She's free. Oh, my God. My stinks, and I'm not in the mood today. I ate something bad earlier, and it's upset my stomach, and if I catch one whiff of that, I'm going to throw up. Oh, I can't, shit, I Dad. I can't take it. I can't take it. You should have just told her something by now all these years. You never told her if she stinks like shit. How the hell she not smell her own quack, man? That's what I'm trying to figure out. I don't know. I never had a stinky one like that. Come, you can't tell me you ain't ever gone into the shitter when she's done. Caught a whiff of that shit. I just figured it was her shit. I mean, yeah, it does smell like shit now that you put that like that. I just had an epiphany. What? Have I been banging her butthole the whole time? Dad. Oh. Actually, that could... That could explain a lot here. But that don't explain how I caught that gonorrhea back in 1973 when I met her, though. And I know that from her. She's the only one I was banging back then. Gonorrhea yeah. in bubbles? <laughs> oh, Dad. Holy she, I shit. I think Mom's got some explaining to do when you get back in there. Son, we're going to have to go to the liquor store tonight because I can't. I'm not going to be able to take this shit sober. We're going to the store. All right. No. Well, Dad, what I'm trying to figure out is why'd you stay with her after all these years then? It's still better than my old right hand. This fucker's covered in calluses and riddled with arthritis, man. I can't get a grip on that fucker anymore.